trustee that goes uh, travel that effect the cricketers we saw and then there was no practice uh, you don't get a chance to practice with your boys uh, and thirdly the final match abandonment so really these all things are frustrating yeah look it hasn't been ideal but it's the same for both sides no excuses um, that's what both teams had to have we see this at the same yesterday it would be nice to bowl first today but we lost the toss but that's part of the game like i said i'm sure there'll be an improvement in the second game because a couple of guys were trusty, haven't played for a couple of weeks. Um, we think of Riyadh's last game was probably in South Africa. Um, our fifth last game for Bangladesh was in South Africa. That's a couple of months ago, so they'll get better as the season goes on. We saw Coach that announced that for the long time. And when he was betting, it looks that he is very much positive. Uh, what's your uh, comment about it? No, look, he's, he's coming to the test side and the T20 side. And he's really liking the Bangladesh side. No, look, he's coming to the test side and the T20 side. We really like what we see. Um, the good technique. Looks to score, got a good presence, good fielder, which is so important. So great to have a player like that coming into the side. But he's experiencing a lot of form behind his name. Um, he needs to get a score. Uh, he's got a couple of starts. Um, but really excited about what I've seen with him over the last couple of years. Let's start. Coach, uh, probably looks like same old story top order collapsing. Look, we're 45 for 2. We got off to a good start. Um, and then just some really poor cricket. Um, look, I'm sure we'll be better in the next game. Guys have had a long boat trip, no practice yesterday. Um, it's been a bit disruptive, so we're very fortunate that that game got trained off, and at least we had a bit of a hit today. We usually got 12, 13 hours of practice and back into T20 mode, so I'm sure we'll see an improved performance in the second game. But practice session in the match win, of course, it's a big setback. At the same time, people, some of the players are actually sick during the boat trip. You are directly, we are directly. So, how much has affected the players mentally and physically? No, look, no excuses. It was the same for the West Indies. They didn't have a practice either yesterday. They were also in the same boat. Um, so, no excuse. But look, some guys haven't played for a couple of weeks. You think of a fifth year. Um, they haven't played any cricket. They've been practicing back in Dakar. So, at least they had a little bit of game time here today. And I'm sure we'll put in a better performance in the second half. Yeah, it was positive, but Shakib got out to the wrong time. Um, he knows that. Um, we need someone to get big scores. We need those in this form. We need a good partnership. And as soon as the partnership started developing, we lost the wicket. And Shawan, I think, can be a really important player for us in this format. He's a powerful guard, big hit at the back end, and gives us a new dimension, but also took the wrong option of these dismissals. So there's learning there for him, but good to see him in good form because he's carrying some form from the test messages. Bowlers, your batters, they at least had a chance to bat on, but your bowlers, they're actually out of any practice, out of any match. Yeah, it's the same for both sides. Like I said, there's no excuses. It's, it's the way it is. The international schedules, there's not much time in between games now. We've just got to find the best way to deal with it. Um, look, we we're going to play three spinners today, so they would have been ready to go. And Fizz has played a test match, and Shoyful has come for a test match, so the bowling attack was ready to play.